as the sun sets on Old Morok village, these emaciated animals slowly make their way to the communal holding point of the village. It is a practice that the residents resorted to following numerous cattle raids in the area, which not only left many villagers destitute, but has also led to the death of scores of villagers. The arrival of cows marks the end of the day for many, but the beginning for these home guards. The carcasses of the cows provide the much needed food for these home guards as they keep watch of the depleted animal stocks. Sasa sisi nakaa tu kwa misuni kulala kuangalia wadu yetu. Sasa nasunguka hii boma, ayewe silala mpaka mpaka asubuhi. Soon after, the guards take their positions. From treetops to the perimeter fence surrounding the holding point. Anyone coming close to this fence is bound to be repulsed. Kama si mavunduki serikali yamepeana katika Samburu. Hakuna Samburu saa hii ina mufu. Samburu angekuwa yamekwisha na hata utaona hii ngombe na kupa kupa. This shed is strictly restricted to warriors and the home guards. Women, children and goats spend the night in six camps which are kilometers away from the men in a bid to save them from the vagaries of cattle rustling as their men keep vigil. For these people, livestock represent both a blessing and a curse in that while the animals represent wealth for them, they are also the target of raiders. But despite this risk, they have vowed not to give up this age-old practice of rearing animals. Sababu ya Samburu, abana usa ngombe, hata iki usa wa jenge goroba. Si hata goroba hile muna jenga Nairobi na anguka tu. All in all, they maintain that they are a forgotten lot. Si kali angalia sisi kama anawesikana. Now the question that begs is, is the government ready to enhance security in this area? Franklin Masharia, Citizen TV, El Morok, Samburu.